A 41 year old woman of Kitwe who is in the same class with her 19 year old son says her desire to become a nurse has made her defy all odds and return to school. Given Muila, who is also a prefect at Parkland Secondary School, says she does not feel out of place with her teenage son in the same class. Paul Shalala caught up with Given and now reports. Like many other mothers, her day starts quite early. But her day is very involved because she combines many roles. Apart from sweeping the yard and taking care of the plates, Given Muila must also ensure she's in time for school. At 41, this mother of three of Kitwe's Chimwemo Township is still going to school. Interestingly, Given is in the same class with her 19-year-old son Chishala at Parkland Secondary School. Every working day, Given and her son have to prepare themselves for school together. They also leave home together at around 06 hours. Luckily for them, a neighbor owns a public service minibus with which he takes them to school. He picks them up just outside their home at exactly 06.15 hours. On this 20 minutes ride, they do not pay as the bus owner has made it a policy to help them out. The two usually arrive at 06.35 hours ahead of class, which starts at 07.40. Her decision to go back to school was not an easy one. And even the school authorities had hesitated to enroll her. Old people like me, older than me going back to school, then I thought, even me, I should go back to school. Even that one can go back, what about me? Then I was just telling my husband, no, I want to go to school. Then he said, ah, upomwambila. He won't even go because it's a long time that you started going. You're saying I will go back to school. When we went there, we were at two with my friend. Then we went there, we asked for Mrs. Mulomba. Then he said, ah, you guys, what do you want? As old as you are. Then we said, no, we want school. We want to enter. Uh, for grade nine. Grade nine. Then we said yes. Then yeah, that's how we took us to one of the teachers who was responsible for the exams. Then he, he was told these people want to register or to enter. They want to write grade nine. Then he said, ah, no, you must be joking. Then we said, no, we are serious. Then he said, no, there's no place for you. Then we said, no, God does something for us. And there's a place for us too. Her dream is to be a nurse. Uh, actually, I like uh, nursing. Now, uh, very light nursing is very expensive. I don't know. Maybe teaching, that's the other option. Being a prefect and the oldest pupil at the school, Given has become a darling to many of her schoolmates. I spent, about, I spent one year here with the uh, Given and it has been a very great experience with her because she acts uh, like a mother to us and a very caring person who everyone re will relies on. Apart from her being our schoolmate, she is also like a mother to us. Yeah, because the things uh, that she does are more like she's a teacher and not a student. Uh, that's how our mother takes care of us, uh, the way she does. Her son Chishala does not mind being in the same class with his mother. I started learning with my mother since grade 10 and it was nice to see the company with her and my friends, they, they treat her as their own mother. However, the mother jokingly says she intervenes if her son misbehaves in class. You know when he's with uh, uh, his fellow classmates, sometimes he's he misbehaves sometimes but if he sees me i just do this <laughs> then uh, i like uh, saying when i enter in one of the classes i like saying hello so when i go there they will just say hello they will shout at me hello and others say ah, how are you were given how are you just like that over the past years given has been at parklands she has made many friends i don't consider the age because I know that when, when I'm with her, we talk things that are related to education. 
we only talk about school stuff as well as you know religious things since we congregate in the same church and the school authorities say they decided to appoint her as a prefect because she was an inspiration to the whole school i suppose with her um, attributes that she has of being hard working being disciplined and uh, also being firm those are some of the characteristics we looked at and chose her to be a prefect and education authorities in kitwe few given story will inspire many others it's a grand story uh, in fact it qualifies to be the story of the year uh, for our young lady who is 41 years old uh, to be learning with her own child. I think it's, it's a challenge on her part. It's equally a challenge on the part of the child and many other children that she's competing with. I think we just want to encourage the young lady to forge ahead and complete her education and um, you know, realize her dreams of either becoming a nurse or whatever she would want to become. Given story is an inspiration that is all because of a desire to fulfill a dream. Paul Sharala, ZNBC News in Kitwe. School girls in Lufanyama district have called for more.